Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to my Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. I gotta be careful because I've yet to fight that kid. Anyhow, last time I got through Pattern... Well, I'm not through Pattern Bush. There's still a lot to do here. I gotta switch somebody out. Dodo, it is your turn. All right, let's get started this right away. Hey, kid! You know, it just doesn't feel right if I don't use bug Pokemon. Well, that makes sense. I mean, you're a bug catcher, right? Anyhow, let's see what you're packing. Oh, a Yanma! Shane, this was before they became Yan Mega. I'm almost out of drill pick, I gotta be careful. Alright, what else do you have? You have Yanma. You, pro you might have a Heracross. Dodo's level 62 now, that's good. Gotta make sure she doesn't go too far, though. Don't want her going over the level limit so soon. Even though the likelihood of that happening is pretty low. Do you have nothing but Yanma? I mean... Alright, that's cool with me if that's the case, but otherwise... I don't know. It feels silly to have a team full of Yanma in this generation. Oh, nope, there's a Beedrill. Yellow Jay, look away. I'm sorry, I gotta put down your your boy here. So there's two Yanma, a Beedrill. Do you have a Butterfree, perchance? Hmm? Oh, nope, two Beedrill, alright. Yeah, well, let's go with Tri-Attack this time. Beedrill's defense is so low and... Might knock it out in one hit, who knows? Yeah, oh, that was a crit! I'll never know for sure now. Damn it, Dodo, you're too good. It's okay, losing is a fun part of a Pokemon's appeal, too. You know, in this context, that just came across to me as you like looking at corpses. All right, alas, what does she have? You know what, Jupiter has not had some fun. Let's have him out come out and play. Take a deep breath. <sighs> Isn't the air delicious? I don't know. I've been dealing with a cough the past several days, so... Can't really smell the air without risking me, like, hacking my lungs out. And oh, great, you have a hop hip. Perfect for everyone but Jupiter, pretty much. Oh, and Bailey. It's not so good for Bailey, either. Yellow Jay, I'm sure you can handle this thing. I don't want Dodo to have too much fun here. Some fun is okay, but let's not have too much. And really, you're putting me to sleep. All right. That's fine. I could, hmm. You know what, I'm not even gonna deal. Let's just wake you up. It's one healing item done. Ooh, a leech seed. That pretty much means the LFJ has to get out of here ASAP. That's lovely. You're lovely, Hot Bip. Ooh, that took out 28, 20 HP too. Sorry if this is a bit, like, kind of rushed, um, I re I'm recording this kind of late on Sunday, and on Sunday, I have to play D&D with some buddies. So, yeah, D&D's in less, less than an hour and a half from now, so I kind of have to hurry this up a bit. So if these two episodes are shorter than usual, I apologize. Yeah, let might be able to, oh yay, he got the level up! Cool. Still crappy stats, though. Okay, at this point, I might want to switch Yellow J out because Skip Blue might survive a secret power. I'd rather rather not deal with whatever that thing's got up its sleeve. So, Hextor, I hate defaulting to you so much, but I'm gonna need your help here. Oh yeah, I was going. To, well, it wouldn't hurt Yellow J that much. I mean, he is just like. He's four times resistant to grass, so... And even the Hextor's also four times res resistant, so... Let's just... Bull this thing over with wing attack. And let me guess, you also happen to have a jump bluff? Because I can see you having a jump bluff. Do ya? Nope, it's too skip -lum. Why don't you have a jump bluff? Come on, man. Give it the times. And with that, you are done, lass. But you gotta save yourself. Hmm? If you'd like, I can teach you how to breathe properly. Wouldn't be a bad idea. I mean, that might help my voice out a bit. I've been trying to improve my voice as of late. Uh, no, crap. I meant to heal Yellow Jay. Kind of slacking off as of late, though, thanks to that cough of mine. So, yeah. Gotta get back into that as soon as possible. And the repel wore out. Great. You know, I think I'd be confused if I didn't edit the previous episode earlier today. Okay, I'm gonna have to hope that this guy does not have something Jupiter can't deal with. Hey, come back here. This is a good spot. I'll pitch my tent here. 
All right, a camper. That's fine. Pincer, okay. So much for that. Sheesh. Poor Jupiter. He is not having, having any fun here, is he? Well, it's all right, I'm, ooh. Dodo, you're gonna need to kill this thing quick because sword stance is not so good on a pincer. And by that, I mean it's like, pincer can wreck your shit normally. A sword stance will make it wreck your shit even quicker or whatever. All right, do you have another pincer? Oh no, it's hair across, cause you wanna mock me, don't you? Get that blue beetle out of my face. <laughs> Using a hair across, how dare you? <laughs> Wimp tell. All right, what you gotta say for that? I'm going to observe the night sky here. You can see the night sky through all this? Look, whatever, let's just get out of here. Welcome to the green path, which is nothing but ocean. That makes sense. I don't think I can catch anything by surfing, so I'm gonna need to try fishing. So this is probably gonna take a while. Let's try fishing for a Pokemon on the green path. Cause I don't think there's any grass here. Pokemon's on the hook, what is it? Oh, that didn't take long. Hi, Quillfish. Level 17, so... Could Leech Seed. Let's do that. Ah, uh, nope, it evaded the attack. Oh no, minimize, really? Really? That just means there's a bigger chance of me missing. Ah! Stop with your minimize, please. Please stop. Please stop. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna start chucking Ultra Balls after this because it seems like you're content on spamming, spamming minimize. All right, let's try it. Ultra Ball, go! I got 43 of them. I can just throw them all day. Ah. Uh. Oh no, Poison Stake. What am I to do? Gotta love that my voice gave out at right there. Beep, 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 beep. One, two, three. Damn it, Quillfish! Yeah, Water Gun's gonna be a bigger help. Let's try Leech Seed again. Ah. Uh. My one concern is that this thing could have rollout, and I don't I don't know what'll happen in that case. Cause then it's like, oh dear. I don't wanna like Ah, uh, stay in the ball, will ya? Alright, now I know you don't have rollout, so any fears I have, gone. Let's try again. Come on. Mmm. I would rather not spend the entirety of this episode trying to catch a quillfish. And I'm not using the Master Ball either. I'm using, I'm saving that for something special. Not quite sure what that special something is. I'm gonna have to pick between two things here. Come on, you. Do I have to skip to when I finally catch this thing? Because, you know, I'd rather not waste all of my Ultra Balls on this. One, two. Mm. Why is it always Quillfish? Like, in the test Nuzlocke, I wound up having a really hard time catching this thing. Thank you, Leech Seed finally hit. And I don't know why. Like, in the test Nuzlocke, I wasted all my balls trying to catch this thing, so I wound up having to use the Master Ball. This is the thing I wasted a Master Ball on. That's my most embarrassing thing with that. Now please, stay in the ball, will you? One. Mm. I don't have all night. I have something I gotta do in less than about an hour from now. So come on, just make it easier for mm. make it easier for all of us and stay in the ball. Come on. Get in the. Mm. It's all right. It's okay. Either you get in the ball or you die a slow and painful death. I can catch you elsewhere! You're all over the waters here! So just make it easier for all of us and stay in the ball. Come on. Yeah. <sighs> you know, I'm gonna be disappointed if I wind up wasting all of my Ultra Balls on this thing. I'd really rather not. So I'll tell you what. 
When it gets down to 30, if it gets down to 30, two, three. Hey, never mind. I don't have to worry about it. It's gonna say I'll just start chucking poke pokeballs and grape balls at it. Quillfish, the balloon Pokemon. The small spikes covering its body developed from scales. They inject a toxin that causes fainting. Ugh, really. Uh, you're a nuisance. Mm, I'm trying to think of what to name this thing. How about Chowder? Cause I, I honestly cannot bring myself to like Chowder. I really can't. Like really, I can't bring myself to like that show. Like my boyfriend loves it. I don't know why he loves it, but he does. Now Bailey and Jupiter are the only ones who've yet to level up. So let's just have them fight here. Huh? I was envisioning my house, but this is where I teleport? Oh no, a psychic? Oh crap, I forgot there were female psychics around here, shit. Oh, even worse, it's not too. Right then, you gotta get out of there, Jupiter. Let's have Nyx come in. Cause Nyx has something that can take care of these things. Provided she does not hurt herself in confusion too much. Now let's see. Let's try Shadow Ball. And please hit it and not you, Nyx. Thank you. Thank you very much. Nice. Nice one there, Nyx. Now who's... I'm guessing another not... No slow, bro. Okay. Oh, shit. I'm confused, right? Uh. Hmm. Haha, -ha, you can't put me to sleep. I have insomnia. Of course, the last time I bragged about that, a Pokemon wound up dying, so I'm kind of concerned. Oh, it survived. Ooh, psychic. That's, uh, that's not gonna do much. It's gonna do 16 damage. And not even a special defense drop. And for at an insult, Nick snapped out of confusion. Goodbye, Slowbro. With all the experience Nyx is bound to get, she might level up. Well, maybe. Depends on how much this last one gives. Kadabra! Alright. Oh no, a psychic. What am I gonna do? That did 20 damage. Oh, that got the special defense drop. Well, good thing Shadow Ball is very likely gonna knock you out. See? This is why Nyx is gonna be so helpful com coming up. Because the rival's still gonna have his Alakazam. Big Boo Boo! What's that supposed to mean? I mean, aside from the fact that you teleported out here. I'm so scatterbrained! I need to focus so I can teleport properly to my house! But yeah, uh, what was I talking about earlier? Oh yeah, Chowder. Like, I don't know why. I, I guess it's because I seem to have an, an internal hatred for characters who do nothing but, you know, hinder the hinder other characters or something. Like, that's why I don't like Billy, because he's he does nothing but make things worse. Chowder, from what I can recall, does nothing but make things worse. It's also why I don't like Dodo, the Doctor Who companion, not my Dodrio. Yeah, see, I have a habit of naming any Dodo I catch Dodo, because... Hey, Dodo, that's like, what kind of the basis of their name, right? Dodo, Doduo, I don't know. But point is, I have a real dislike for characters that just hinder the char hinder everyone else's lives. I didn't lose to you at swimming. This doesn't bother me. Oh, I didn't even pay attention to the fight here. Aside from, oh, it's a swimmer. Oh, it's Meryl. What is this? I think it's Outcast Island? Why is it called Outcast Island, then? Yeah, this is Outcast Island, altering caves up ahead. That useless cave. Big Sister, help! Please battle with me! Geb? That's an interesting name. I mean, Ava and Geb. Ooh, Starmie, that might be a problem. Who's up ahead? Yellow Jay. Right, we gotta focus on that Starmie. Like, really focus, because Starmie might really wreck my shit. It might know Psychic, and that's what I'm worried about. Jupiter, can you outspeed? Okay, good. Okay, it's not Poliwhirl I'm worried about, it's- Oh! 
Nice. And Starmie's gone. That is good. Because if Starmie was able to hit with, say, Psychic, or Jupiter probably would have survived, but I don't know about Yellow Jay. Wow, big sister, this person's really good! Uh, thank you. I'm hanging on to my sister because I can't touch the bottom while you're in the sea. You know, I do prefer the sea over any pool. Yeah, well, I have a fear of drowning, so I would take a pool over the sea any day. Up, uh, that does count as a uh, number one for Outcast Island. I need to remember that. Let's see, what else? There's another swimmer here. <laughs> I swam here from Six Isle Port in one go. Why would you do that? I mean, I don't know how far away. S oh, right, Six Isle Port. That's somewhere close. I don't remember. Mm. Gotta love how I don't remember certain things. My first thought was, wait a minute, aren't I around Five Island? And then I remembered, oh wait, no, I'm not. I'm around Six Island. Okay, you had a Kingler and... War Turtle! Alright, I'll just Razor Leaf ya. I doubt you'll survive it. See? You didn't survive it. Mimo? <laughs> I'm only at the halfway point. I'm beat. Well, that's understandable. Is there a hidden item here? I think there might be a, hid a hidden item here. Let's see. No, there's not. That's a waste of a space then. All right, let's just keep going around here. Nope, number two. Is it another tent? Oh, it's Tentacruel. Well, I already have Tentacruel, so this doesn't count. Good thing, too. I don't know how lucky... Oh, hi there. What are you doing here? There's no rare Pokemon around these parts. Not a one! That burns me up, man. I'll take it out on you. Hey, don't look at me, man. I mean, it's your fault. You're the one who decided to show up here. Ah, uh, Mook! Level 48, too. These guys are getting stronger. Jupiter, you're not going to be any good for this. Let's head out Nyx instead. We'll have it use Psychic on this suit. Okay, good, you missed with Screech. If you did hit with Screech, I would have been worried because... Muck can hit hard after a Screech. Heck, if I remember right, can still hit hard anyway. But it doesn't matter, Nyx knocked it out. And we'll get the level up from that, cool. Alright, next up is... Radicate! Ooh, Radicate. A... Mm. I think I'll be okay. Because my first thought was maybe I should switch to Bailey, except I don't know what his last Pokemon is. It might. Oh, yeah, well, he was planning on hitting me with Pursuit. Well, joke's on you. I have a lot of special defense. You mean, while well, you probably don't have a good special attack stat, so there. What's his last Pokemon? Ah, Golbat. Okay, so. Psychic! Doo doo doom. Goodbye. Oh, that was a crit, too. Sheesh. Nice going, Nyx. And you're done, Mr. Grunt. Huh? Don't you huh me. So listen, uh, you haven't seen any rare Pokemon, have you? No, I have not. And if I- and this is what, what I think it is, you won't find them here, either. Yeah, this is Old Train Cave, everyone. There's nothing here. I- I mean- Nothing but Zubat. So if you want a Zubat, you're good. Level 12 Zubat at that. They're not even that strong. So yeah. Fuck this place. I don't want to be involved in it. I don't think there's any grass on these islands, though. So chances are I'm not going to be able to find anything here. That's This is number three. And we were going to get out of here. Don't want to waste any time with a tentacool when I already have so little time as it is. Oh, hey, a fisherman. Let's get this thing. A pee pee up, all right. Hi, sir. I'm having no luck at all. A battle to be a change of pace. Well, sure. I'll fight you. What you got, man? Better not be a bunch of magic harps. Quillfish, though. That's not much better. <laughs> right, I'm gonna have Nyx come out and play then. 
Uh, every time it seems Jupiter will have a break, she doesn't, or he doesn't get it, rather. Revenge, oh no, what am I gonna do about that? Psychic. Let's see how well you do against this. The answer is not very, you didn't take care of that very well, did ya? That's what you get. Friggin' taking an eternity to catch. Sheesh, after this I really do need to go heal. Because, man, this is just getting, this is getting bad. I'm nearly out of PP for several moves. Nope, no luck at all. All right, let me just, there might be, I don't know if it's here or elsewhere, but there might be, no, I don't think it's here. There's actually, yeah, no, I don't think this is it. This is like a, there's like an area called, I have dogs barking outside, I apologize for that. There's, yeah, I'm pretty sure I can't catch anything here, but let me just, let me go get the, where's the, there's the super rod. Come on, something pick, grab the line. And my final chance, it's horsey? I've already caught horsey, it doesn't matter. So no encounter from me. No encounter from me and Outcast Island. I wonder why it's called Outcast Island anyway. Perhaps I should fly back. I might be better off doing that. Would save me some time. You know what, yeah, let's fly back. Let's fly back. Let's just get Dodo. Wonder how flying would work in Dodo's case. I mean, she doesn't have wings. Does she jump really high or something? Does she use her legs to kinda wobble in the air like you're sh Hi, what are you doing here? Hey, Em, how's your Pokedex filling up? It looks like it's impossible to get all the Pokemon by hanging around just these parts. Maybe there are Pokemon we don't know about somewhere far away. Well, if I can't do it, there's no way for you to get it done. I don't care how lucky you are, what with you beating me to become the champion. I'm not gonna get all desperate over this. I'll keep collecting Pokemon at my own pace while I train them. That's what I'll do, so there's no point in staying here. I may as well leave for home. Maybe take back the championship while I'm at it. That's that, then. Smell you later! <sighs> what the he Where have you been, you stink? Anyway, since I just checked the northern part of Six Island, I think I got enough time to check out the southern part. Where Ruin Valley awaits. And Ruin Valley, <laughs> that's gonna be a bit of a chaotic time, so I'm gonna make sure of a couple things first. First off, I'm gonna get some repels. And I do mean repels, I need to get plenty of them. Dream mail. Uh, I never see the point of mail. Just get some mail. Second off, I want to make sure I have a specific item on me. I hope I manage to buy it. Um, do I have it? Is it in my PC? It better be in my PC, because otherwise that means I'm going all the way back to Celadon to get this. I don't know if I want to spend some time going all the way back there. So let's check my PC. Is it in here? Welp! Mails to deposit some items first. And then I'm gonna go back to Celadon because I need to grab a very specific item. So I will be right back, everyone. Alright, everyone, I am back in Celadon because I need to grab an item. A very specific item because Ruin Valley is gonna be a bit of a treacherous place to get through. I need not a Pokemon. Is it, no, that's, that's TMs. What I need is a smoke ball. Because Ruin Valley, if memory serves me right, is home to Wobbuffet. And anyone who's played a Nuzlocke probably knows how freaking terrifying a Wobbuffet can be. Because of everything Wobbuffet can do. If you attack it, there's a 50% chance that it'll hit with either Counter or Mirror Coat. Which means all the damage is dealt back to you, but doubled, depending on what type of move it is. Counter affects physical moves, Mirror Coat affects special moves. And if that's not enough, Wobbuffet knows Safeguard, which means that it'll keep itself from getting hit with poison or whatever. And even worse, if, it, if it's almost dead, 
it can very easily decide to say fuck you and use Destiny Bond in an attempt to take you with it. So yeah, whoever's coming up front has to st has to have the smoke ball, which will likely be... Oh, there's a berry here. It's a Lepa Berry. Oh, Alright, that's not bad. As I was saying, whoever's coming up front needs to have the smoke ball on them. I'm fine for now. I'm still on the water path. Pineapple Berry. Already caught somebody here. This is where I caught Scout. Oh, Oddish. Level 44 Oddish at that. That's, I don't know. I, I find this a bit weird. Level 44 Oddish. Oh, there's a hiker up ahead. Might be a good idea for me to keep, um, get Jupiter up front for this. I'm not at the Ruin Valley yet, so I don't need to throw on the smoke ball. An Aspir Berry. Okay. Ah. I see. You look away. You look at me, then want to show up. Tell me, where are the mountains around these parts? Uh, well, you're right by Ruin Valley, so... I mean, there's not really a, uh, mountain here? There's just a ruined valley. Now, Razor Leaf. This should take care of Onyx in one hit. I'm just hoping that I do not miss at the worst possible moment. Oh, God help me if I do. And... Mud Choke. Alright, this is fine. I'll just do that. Oh, not cool revenge. This is gonna hurt a bit. Not a whole lot, though, thankfully. Alrighty, then. Machoke is down. And Jupiter finally gets the level up. Thank God. I lost my way while I was busy battling! Sounded like you lost your way well before that. Aren't there any mountains around these parts? Don't ask me, I just got here. And now, I am here. I am officially in Ruin Valley, and I need to throw the smoke ball on Jupiter. Yes, I know you already got the Miracle Seed, but we have to have you carry around the smoke ball for now. Because of potential Wob effects. But if I remember right, the other Pokemon you can get here is Larvitar. That would be so cool if I got a Larvitar. Okay... I guess this probably means I'm not getting an encounter because Natu can teleport. Huh. I mean, it's better than Wobbuffet. I can potentially use a Natu, at least. Okay, I got Natu. Good. My first thought is that thing is going to teleport before I can even catch it. Natu, the tiny bird Pokemon. I gotta assume it's tiny bird. There's no way. It's just called the tiny Pokemon. It usually forages for food on the ground, but may, on rare occasions, hop onto branches to peck at shoots. Alright, welcome board, not two. You know what, I, I like alliteration. Let's go with... Oh wait, that won't work later. Ah, uh, never mind. I can't think of an, an X name. I'll just call you Natty. Natty the not two. Well, so much for Larvitar, but again, Natu is a better option than Wobbuffet. Still, I'm keeping the smoke ball on just in case. I think I'll record for a little bit longer, maybe fight some trainers here. Maybe. Am I gonna have enough time? Because that's the thing I'm worried about. Time. It's not on my side. Oh, there's something down there. What is that? Alright, is this... Oh, it's a Fira. Okay. Of course this does! There is one other place you can get Wobbuffet Oh, I'm not used to that animation. <laughs> there is one other place you can get Wobbuffet, which is why I'm like, I don't know, anymore, like... Sadly, that place is Cerulean Cave. And there's a bunch of other cool stuff you can get there. Including Mewtwo if you're allowing yourself to catch legendaries in your Nuzlocke, but... Uh... Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't remember if I ever said anything about that. About catching legendaries and Nuzlocke. Because, well... I don't know, like... There is something special I would like to try, to try catching with the Master Ball. Um... Oh. It's, uh... Some, which, which way do I go? Crap, I don't remember. There's a trainer up there and someone down there. Already caught a Natu, thank you very much. 
The animation is annoying, but it's necessary because we're in Wobbuffet country. Alright. I think as soon as I fight that hiker up there, I'll call it an episode. That might be a good idea. As soon as the animation ends. And there's the hiker. Hey, you. A battle with you so high up. I don't think I read that right. Um, A battle with you so high up. Oh, it's Shudo Wudo. That reminds me, there's this one Nuzlocke like I'm doing at the moment on Pokemon Gold and... Not hard gold, regular gold. I got that on the virtual console. And it's just... Sudowoto damn near killed my starter, alright? I just barely caught it in time because it was also poisoned and in the red. Oh, the heartbreak of losing so easily to you! Eh, you'll get used to it. Experience the joy of climbing! No thank you. Alright, this. How do I do this? I think I do... yeah. Full restore! Alrighty then. I'm gonna call that an episode, guys. Next time, I'm gonna explore the rest of Ruined Valley. And I do believe there is one other area I can check out around here. Since I find the town, town map. The Dotted Hole. wonder what that's about. Alright, everybody. I will catch you later!